In this tutorial, we will learn how to set up client viewers in Capture One Studio. These can be used to give clients independent views away from Capture One's main viewer. They are not designed for interaction, for example, rating and color tagging, but simply an additional way to view the shoot without crowding the main capture station. Options for client viewers are found in the window menu. Each client viewer can operate in one of three modes. Let's take a look at the first one, pin selected. Subsequently, any image in the browser can be sent to the client viewer by right clicking on it and choosing pin to client viewer and the desired viewer. To pin a different image to a different client viewer, simply right click on it and choose a different viewer. Note that in the browser, a visual indicator is shown on any thumbnail which is displayed in any of the client viewers. You can also pin multiple images to the same client viewer. Now let's look at follow selected. Choosing this simply sends the selected image in the browser to the chosen client viewer. The client viewer will show exactly what the main viewer in Capture One is showing, including the possibility to view multiple selected images. Finally, choosing Follow Capture will simply follow the latest tether capture. Subsequent tether captures will then be sent to this viewer. Please note, regardless of the mode, the client viewers show a fully rendered image. Client viewers also display composition tools such as guides, grids, overlays, AI crop rules and crop overlays, and the before and after slider. You can choose which composition tools you want the client viewers to show by going to Settings, Appearance. Keyboard shortcuts for the client viewer are available in the Keyboard Shortcut Editor. They can be found in the Window section.